is going on YouTube. Dr. Rod, damn, my controller just fucked up. <laughs> What's going on YouTube? Dr. Rod Way here. And uh, the first thing that you want to do when you first get into the game, which is really important, I'm about to teach you how to set up your bag. I'm not going to just say this is what you do. I'm going to actually tell you the fucking thought process behind what the hell I'm doing. So, hella items drop when you play the game. And you don't really want to go around picking up everything individually. You definitely can. And I definitely do some items like that. But I'm not about to pick up 100 fucking items a game. I'm just not going to do it. And I don't suggest that you do it. So, first thing you want to do is when you go to options and then you go over to gameplay, you'll see the auto loop filter. And basically, let me reset it from default. So, firstly, you want to select where you pick up. You want to pick up everything in the beginning because you ain't got shit, obviously. So, you want to pick up all weapons, all armor, all accessories. And that's just because you don't have anything. You want to at least look at it in your inventory and, and at least have eyes on the item so you can make a decision yourself whether you want to keep it or not okay and then I would select all of these um, the different rarities of the gear so when you first start out the game obviously you're gonna be getting common you get a little bit farther uncommon then rare epic and eventually you'll get the legendary mythical so on and so fucking forth right so let's say you start getting a whole bunch of uncommon gear right and you mainly getting uncommon you can uncheck common right and what that'll do is that you'll start getting gear that's um just uncommon and up and then it would sell automatically all of that common gear and then you can do the same thing once you start getting all rares you unselect that one then you you know you start getting all epics unselect rare then you get the epic and then you just do just legendaries okay now it's a little bit trickier and for the sake of not confusing you guys right now I'm just gonna say you can keep doing it like that but I'll make a new video for once I make enough videos where I feel like you would have enough information to understand what I'm doing next I could probably explain it to you in this video you know what fuck it you guys are smart enough I'm gonna explain it to you in this video okay so once you get to legendary this is about the time you get to like the early late game or like kinda like that I guess late mid game so to speak um, so you're not like in game super badass but like you can hold your fucking on okay so then you start getting um, what what's different about like all of these let's go here I'm trying to show you something ignore these like all these goals right so all of these uh, gold uh, gear or legendary so to speak um, is a little bit different so you'll see that if you look at the top uh, left of the menu that shows that item you'll see it's level 1 out of 58 so you know not every legendary is created equal like some legendaries have way more upgrades that you can uh, put into uh, the legendary gear right so with that being said some you I don't want the legendary gear that's giving me less I want uh, less level ups I want the gear that's giving me more level ups right so when you first get into the legendary tier you'll get upgrades that might be like 40 or 50 right but eventually you'll start getting ones that give you 60 70 80 sometimes 90 max upgrades that's when you check this and then okay I don't want anything that has less than 55 upgrades boom or whatever it is you really don't have to do that until you get to legendary tier so uh, just keep that in mind okay so that's pretty much how you would edit out uh, your bag now that uh, where you can not add it, add it at your bag but edit the auto loop filter so you can pick up stuff and make sure that you click yes to apply now in your inventory you can select um, you can select you know sort out the gear the way that you want it and you don't have to do it like this but I, I do like the way that I did it 
So my first three bags are weapons. Um, and then different weapons can be used by different heroes. So what I did was that I made my first bag a staff. Um, right? First bag's a staff. And that's the apprentice weapon, whatever. You don't know about the characters yet. Um, then this one right here, you can't see it, but it has like all of the melee weapons in it, basically. Um, for the monk and the squire. And this one has um, all of the stuff for like the EV and the huntress, the range weapons. Essentially, it's not a staff. Um, and then there's different armor sets. You got Ancient Guard, Militia, Minor, and Primitive. And then I just got them where I have each one of those in a different bag, right? Then the last bag um, is um, all the accessories. Boom, there you go. And that's a pretty good way to set up your bags. I haven't found, honestly, a better way then, like, let's say I wanted to, like, sell stuff. I usually go to all, and then, like, um, all usually mark, at least for weapons. You don't need that many. I just keep the first row, and I sort, oh, I forgot. You can sort this. If you click the left stick, you can sort by quality item type. I just do item power. Because in a general sense, the higher the item power, and item power you can see right below the the title of the weapon, item power, this one is 2524, uh, two, you can see that item power, and the ones that have higher item power are in general stronger, um, right? So like these progressively, theoretically speaking, get stronger. Like clearly these top three weapons right here are better than the rest of these, like clearly. So I can even sell these. That's what I uh, do with the weapons. If, if once you do get them in your back, it's not all weapons are created equal. It's not even a point to keep in that. Uh, and these are actually kind of good, but I don't want them. Okay, so that's how you organize your bag. And um, that's pretty much all it is. And I would do that pretty much immediately. There's no reason not to. And that'll help you um, uh, organize and make sense of all of the bullshit you got in your inventory and, and manage it pretty well. So I'll see you in the next one.